Hi, my name is Rolly Magpayo. I'm a filmmaker and photographer. This is the Undoer Motorized Dolly. I discovered this while browsing in Lazada. I haven't seen one before, and since I am finding ways to create cinematic camera movements, I decided to get one. I am going to unbox, set up, explain how this product is used, and how it can improve your filmmaking. If you are new to my channel, please do subscribe and hit the notification bell. And please do like this video. This is the charging cable. This is the extra rubber ring and an Allen wrench. This is the remote control. This is the 1 4th inch and 3 8 inch screw for mounting the camera. Here we have the motorized dolly. It has a built-in rechargeable battery that can last for 6 hours. The whole dolly weighs just 300 grams and have a maximum payload of 3 kilograms. This is the motorized wheel of the dolly. This is where you mount your camera. The camera should be mounted with the lens over the motorized body. These are the two variable angle wheels that you can adjust depending on the movement that you want. Straight, if you want your camera to travel a straight line very much like a slider. Outwards, if you want your camera to rotate around your subject. Inwards, if you want a 360 degree shot. You can also mount a small ball head for more adjustability. You can adjust the speed by pressing this button. The LEDs indicate the current speed selected. There are three speed settings, slow, medium, and fast. This is the direction selector button. This is the power switch. When the battery is low, you can charge it through this micro USB port. The included 1 4th inch and 3 8 inch screw will allow you to mount any camera, ball head, or anything with a 1 4th inch or 3 8 inch threaded hole. You can also mount a gimbal as long as it is within the 3 kilogram payload limit. You can also adjust the variable angle arms if you want to use heavy lenses. The motorized dolly needs a smooth surface to work fluidly. Small bumps or grooves will introduce shakes and vibrations to your shots. The build quality is really good. The body and the arms are made from aluminum. Setup was a no-brainer and it was also easy to use. This motorized dolly is very cheap compared to motorized sliders and length of travel is limited only by the surface it is placed on. Imagine using this on a basketball court. I'm not saying goodbye to my slider yet because this dolly can also be used on the slider rails when you don't have a flat surface to work on. This gadget wins over the slider for the length of travel. And it wins over an adjustable dolly because this motorized dolly produces more consistent movement. I highly recommend this for filmmakers and content creators. It is cheap and very easy to operate, especially when you don't have an assistant to shoot you. It is also very compact and you can place it inside your camera bag, unlike the slider and the non-motorized dolly. Again, my only regret was not buying this sooner. I will be using this to shoot a lot of product videos. Thanks for watching guys and bye bye!